through the hourglass, so are the days of our lives. There. You are unpacked, and you're really here to stay. Great. Hey, you're not going to mind living under the same roof as Xander. Oh, I mind. But as he pointed out, this is a very large house. He even offered to move out, but I didn't take him up on it. But you will run into him. I can handle it. Just seeing him used to make my blood boil, bleeding him for every horrible thing that went wrong, but much more than I blamed Victor. So. Maybe because you weren't planning on marrying Victor. I'm surprised that you held on to this dress. I held on to it because it's a beautiful dress. Not because I'm still in love with Xander. If you say so. <sighs> when am I due? Why would you ask me that? For all you know, I could just be pudgy. True, but I did just hear you talking to your brother about being pregnant, so... Oh, were you listening out the keyhole or something? I live at Kiriakis' house, just like Will. I'm Xander. Xander Kiriakis? Victor's nephew? Will told me about you. Oh, I'm sure he gave me a glowing recommendation. He said to stay away from you. Well, you don't seem like the kind of person who believes everything she is. Look... Mr. Kyriakis, I don't care about you one way or the other. I just don't want my mom to find out I'm pregnant. Please, call me Xander. And no worries, Ali. Your secret is safe with me. What are you saving up for a midnight snack? I'm meeting for two. feel sick? No, it's, uh, it's not that. I've been having this really creepy feeling. About what? 